Hey guys, Konnichiwa. I'm Sishri and welcome to my channel. Hope you guys are doing great. When you travel another country, what is the first thing you have to deal with? Think. Transportation, isn't it? When I came to Japan, the first and best thing I purchased was this card. This IC card. This is a rechargeable card mostly used in trains. But not for the same concern. I mean the bullet train. You can load up to 20,000 and you don't buy ticket every time you get in the station. It can also be used in convenience stores, supermarket, buses, vending machines and many other places in this video i'll show you guys how and where to purchase it let's go to the station this is the machine where you can purchase your sita or passport card i'll get one there's english in the guidance, guidance will be displayed in english Musica. in this one you can register your name and phone numbers in just case if you lose your Sika or passport card you can get the new one for this you need not to register anything so i'll go for this this tells you the information so agree this is the first name and the last name Confirm. i'm Kimil. information so now I'll go for this one house I did so this is my new Sika card my name is Rita Nani Sristi Yadav and this is the recept it looks like this so again I'll show you by Japanese it's already in Nihongo, I mean Japanese. So we'll go for this. And this time I'll show you guys without entering my name, phone number, my date of birth, etc. Now all you have to do is just put 1000 rupees here and you'll get your sweet card done. You can also return it and get your 500 deposit back. It's quite easy to use. Just tap in and tap out in the station. Isn't it easy? What type of card do you use in the country you are living in? Please comment down below. Thanks for watching this video and we'll see you guys in the next video. Till then take care. Bye bye. Matane.